Hi everybody, I'm Christy. I am a marine biologist and have been, I've been living in Jeddah for a long time. This is my home reef and devastation that the storm caused recently has been, was awful to see for the people who dive here frequently. So I just thought I'd speak a little bit about why coral is important for the sea and for the earth. So coral ecosystems provide a great shelter for juvenile fish, so little baby fish born on coral reefs and they're protected from the sort of wider ocean waves and currents and all sorts of things which can be potentially harming. So they hide in the coral, wait until they're a bit bigger and then move into the pelagic or deep ocean so that they can start to breed. Um, it's also very important for protecting coastal regions so waves break over the coral reefs and then protect all of the, the coastal habitat here um, which was especially important for things like mangroves. Um, so when the waves break against the coral, the waves are dissipated, which is exactly what happened at the Sheraton. Broke all of the sort of semi-dead coral fragments, which has caused devastation, essentially, and the reef is not looking at its healthiest right now. So the aim for this propagation is for us to regrow this reef, which will take a couple of years, but it will hopefully become the healthy ecosystem that it once was. Coral is essential also for human beings. We eat a lot of fish, so a big part of the seafood we get is from coral reefs or just off coral reefs. Um, and it's also essential, it creates jobs, it creates, it builds on the economy and the ecosystems and it's just a very important part of life on Earth. Small step for mankind, one giant, one giant stride, stride for the planet. For the planet. <laughs>